Ooh. What did you do, gang? Ooh. Sorry. <laughs> Private jet, you know, to nationals. Very much so. Okay. Oh, oh, there she go. Thank you. You're welcome. Grandma living in Virginia. Anyways, it's my dog Hannah. Hey guys. You want a picture together? Oh, it's a video. Hey, fresh again. You know, a little fresh ones right here. Yeah. Here goes favor. Hey, what up, man? I'm her favorite person, other than her, uh, her girlfriend. That's a reach. That's a reach. I look good. What Eric at? Don't mind Eric. Well, no. I'm trying to eat him. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Why? <laughs> Getting very modest. <laughs> I like it. Very much funeral. Who else dressed up? Sean. Oh. You gotta get the whole bitch for you. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Okay. Dress to impress. Okay. Period. 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 Who else? Period. 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 We're at the mall because people need some Crocs and um, I know. Where do you get it from the mall? Huh? Oh, yeah. Yes, we just in here. Those ones. I thought you was getting them. They're here. Finish our <laughs> checkout <laughs> pre meet. <laughs> yeah, did some blocks. So, four by one exchanges. And that's it. And we're done. And the light is gone. The light is cool right here. Yeah, BJ's. We have 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 Closest to the sun. Um, Venus. <laughs> How many months have 28 days? One. A word. Okay. Okay. If a rooster laid an egg on a roof, yeah. which way would the egg roll? No. That's right. <laughs> I don't really watch what them want to do. I got 
I don't mean to brag Every day I got to share Give me the girl them Every time I look in I'm a man is on the girls I want to find a tune They love it's the sound of all this And I get the feel like I am on the girls We are equipped So give me the girl them Yo in every minute I'm with it Forget the girl them Excuse it and get them regular visit Just give me the girl them Yo them all are fresh I'm in silly last year Me I did the Hey guys, so obviously I am no longer in Eugene and Nationals actually ended about a week and a half ago But after I talk right now, I am going to include our races and pictures and stuff So there will be more stuff after this But I just wanted to sit down and just share my experience in the NCAA as a student athlete and all the stuff that I've gone through on and off the track. Hopefully sharing my experiences to help you, somebody else, I don't know, but I just wanna share. So last year comes and towards the middle of the season, outdoor, I started, you know, finding my way. Like, you know, things were starting to get good for me. I made it to nationals and four events, four events, the 100, 200, 400, 500, who you know making it in all those events, baby. And I thought everything was all good in the hood until regionals came. Like two days before it was time for the women to run, I tweaked my hamstring. Somehow I made it through regionals and I got to nationals and I couldn't even run. Like, I mean, I ran, but obviously I didn't make any finals because I was still injured. So this year comes and this is my last year. Like the entire fall, I really did feel a lot of pressure because it was my last year, like, and I hadn't done anything really statistically that was going to get me a contract like so the season starts in january so right before the season starts same hamstring injury that i had that stopped me from being great last year that came back so i'm dealing with that all indoor i was able to practice here and there finally kind of like figuring out what's wrong with my hamstring and we're doing stuff to make it better fast forward i started being able to run again i had to run myself back in shape so the whole first half of this outdoor season i was running myself back into shapes that i had missed the whole indoor season i wasn't really practicing um so you know like i was doing okay but then at our very last home meet i strained my hamstring my other hamstring but somehow i made it to regionals made it to the finals at regionals and made it out of regionals to nationals yeah made it to nationals and i did terrible at nationals but that's not the point um the point is <laughs> that i got this far with the freaking season that i had and i just want to tell y'all that it don't matter what you've been through that season it don't matter you never know what's gonna happen for you so it's just important not to lose that confidence in yourself and not to lose your faith in God or whoever y'all believe in. So boom. And during this time, what really helped me was going to talk to one of our sports psychologists, which I have never done before. Go talk to those sports psychologists, like use your resources because that's what they're there for. And then I just really start developing a different mentality. Like I just feel like the NCAA puts so much pressure on like not just athletes but like coaches low key because like especially if you're in a conference like the sec like the coaches automatically feel this pressure to like you know like have all their athletes doing well and if you're not doing well you can kick to the side and that's kind of what happened to me like they say track or just sports in general are more so mental than physical and at times like this is really when you have to really like elevate your mentality like you can't let injuries you can't let the way people treat you you can't let all that stuff damage your mental just try to find yourself outside of your sport so that when injuries or just like anything do occur you're not so wrapped in to that so yeah if you didn't listen to everything that i just said it's fine so yeah i'm just gonna show y'all um, some of the races from the meet and some pictures and yeah.
YBH.